guys, it's Chani. I play Portia. I'm a 21-year-old student studying cosmetology down in Fort Lauderdale at the Veda Institute, and I am excited to be a part of this project. Okay. With that being said, so tell us who's the best looking on the cast. You know what? I can't answer that question because there's not one best looking person. I think you guys did a darn good job picking out everyone because everyone here is just amazing looking. That's a safe answer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what is a turn on for you? Um, a turn on for me is someone that's genuine. When you can feel that someone is genuine and sincere in everything that they do, I really, really get turned on by that. Okay. What is your fantasy? I don't have a fantasy. I go with the wind. Really? Yes. Oh. Okay. So I'll try anything once, twice if I like it, and I'll keep going. Adventurous, open minded. Okay, do you prefer thongs or granny panties? <clears throat> Honestly, neither. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Amen. <laughs> have you ever cheated on someone before? I have cheated on someone. I have been cheated on. So. And how do you feel about gay marriage? Um, where, where you at? That's that's what I'm saying. New York, they just got the bill signed. Yeah. So what? I mean, we're spreading. Yes, yeah, we're spreading. Yes. So how do you feel about it? Like, is that something you would do? Yes. Definitely. Yes. Okay. It's cool. Would you say you're more a receiver or a pleaser? Sometimes I can be a little aggressive. So I tend to be a pleaser, but you know the studs with their stud mentalities. You know, some of them like to be the pleaser, so I just have to give in sometimes. Okay. Do you have any embarrassing moments ever? When I used to go to the Boys and Girls Club, uh, we had this trip. It was called a State Education Festival. And we met up in Tampa with different Boys and Girls Clubs around Florida to compete in, you know, different subjects. History, art, connect four, you know, random stuff like that. So when my friend was going up to get an award because she won first place, um, she came back down from getting her award. You know, we were like high-fiving each other. And then she slipped her hand like this and my freaking ponytail fell out. And next thing I know, oh, no. I just looked on the ground and there was my weed. Wow. Yeah, in front of everybody. Can you describe an ideal date. Your ideal date. I mean, I've had some ideal dates. Like I said, I just go with the one. Like one day we were downtown. I went to the Kava bar. We knocked back a couple of Kavas. And then we um we were walking down a little bit more just to see, like I said, just to see what's up. Mm -hmm. And we ran into um off the hookah. So we walked in off the hookah and that day they happened to have salsa dancing lessons. So we just hopped right on in, got mm -hmm. in on that, mm -hmm. smoked a couple of hookahs and called it a night. What's what's kava? Like explain to us. Kava exactly is a is. South, uh, South Pacific root. Um, it's mostly served in a coconut shell and the taste is kind of repulsive. But uh, the chaser is a piece of the best pineapple you will ever have in your life and what it does is it relaxes you um, a lot of people who have like anxiety or sleep problems they take it but sometimes it can give you a very euphoric feeling okay um so this is the first day of filming i'm super excited and i can't wait to start filming the rest of it so you guys make sure you stay tuned and you guys subscribe